Yeah, I really do like being here. Because it's a community project, it's very social. And the people here are very welcoming and they really make you feel at home. So I mean, I have wonderful neighbors and just walking around, you bump into people and everybody greets you. They wanna know what you're doing, where you're going, who you're with, why are you going there? So it's really nice to, to live here and be a part of the relatively relaxed lifestyle that everybody has. Working with people and with the community here on the islands is the way to, to do marine conservation. Rather than just trying to go in and do it yourself, you've got to work with the people that are here and to understand the root of the problem. When volunteers come, they help us with our daily activities. We've done several beach cleans, teaching children, teaching English to the local um, women here at Pila. That's been really interesting because they're so full of energy and they're really keen to learn and uh, we play a lot of games with them so that's always really, it's always really funny. <laughs> When we have volunteers, they come from every, every, any kind of country you can think of and there'll be people that come through and they all have different experiences, different ideas. We've been allowed to really have our input in like creating all the lesson plans for the clubs and stuff, but it's been really good to kind of have a step back because we've got the more experienced volunteers taking the classes more which has been really good as a learning curve for us and then recently we've been given a lot of free reign with the classes. It's really important for the project to have that mix of our team that is here throughout the year as well as the volunteers that come on a regular basis. Okay the happiest moment I've been whilst being here. That's really hard. Oh, there have been so many. See kids really um, happy, or seeing them happy about learning English, coming to the Eco Tier House to play games, but educational games. We played a lot of volleyball on the beach. I haven't played volleyball for years. going to the Malay dinners. When you see something new in the, in the water, when you go snorkeling. All the kids in the school were like dragging us off to the jetty jump. We started jetty jumping loads and the sun was just starting to set and there were these two like these massive seagulls like going overhead. It was just like the perfect picture moment. It was just, yeah, amazing. That would be my highlight. I think it's something everybody should, should try at least once, whether it be eco-tier or something similar, something based on like environmental conservation eco-tourism because you learn so much and you're contributing to something as well. Um, you're not just being a tourist. 